Very simple, but a very powerful thing to do and to redo and to rehearse in life is simply this, let go and let God. Let go of the things that we're holding on to so tightly and how we do hold on to worry and the things that cause us pain we often hold on to greatly the resentments and the anger we hold on to. Let go and let God. Still your thoughts and your senses with the gentle and the loving instruction. Be still. Be still. Be still. And you will feel a gentle response as your busy thoughts relax and as your body relaxes. Be still and let go. How easy it is to let go of concern when the mind is at peace, it's still and the body is relaxed. You let go of fearful, anxious, and unfriendly thought. Be still and let God. God's love and healing. That power will rush in when you become still and you let go of all that would block the way of the beautiful, calm, divine, joyous movement of God good. Be still and listen. God has much to reveal to you. Profound, genius thought. Letting go and letting God is preparing you for divine instruction. It is now time to relax in stillness and know that you are God's beloved child and that all is well with you, your loved ones, and your world. In stillness, you will experience the presence of God. I pray that you become still. I pray that you let go and let God. In the stillness, I pray that you are able to listen and relax in the presence of God. This is based on Psalms 46 verse 10. Be still and know that I am God.